you want to leave so badly? Humph. You are just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove it to me. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Are we about to fight Torio? Welcome back everybody to Planet Boo for episode 2 of Undertale. It's your boy Boo repping Planet Boo. And I'm ready to get back into some action. I don't know about you. All right, here we are. I, we hooked up with Tario back at his crib. Do you smell that? Surprise. It is butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I'll hold off on snail pie for tonight. Here I have another surprise for you. I gotta check out the rest of the house first. The fire isn't burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You could put your hands inside. <laughs> Yo. For some reason, there is a brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. There is some white fur stuck in the drain. Inside the cupboard are cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters. What a nice smell. Too hot to eat, though. The stove top is very clean. Toriel must use fire magic instead. It's a history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated. Far, far into the earth we walked until we reached the cavern's end. This was our new home, which we named Home. As great as our king is, he is pretty lousy at names. The ends of the tools have been filed down to make them safer. Man, pretty much anything and everything you can interact with. Inside is an old calendar from the beginning of 20. These books are worn. They must have been read many times. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Man, this guy's too touchy for me. Is something burning? Make yourself at home. Yeah, dude, he comes off kind of creepy. You have seen this type of plant before, but do not know its name. It sounds like me on Animal Crossing. Dang, the room looking kind of lit, though. Can I actually toggle the lights on and off? Dope. A box of kids' shoes and a disparity of sizes. An empty photo frame. It's really, what does it say? It's really dusty. I wonder if sleeping heals you. All right, so this hat wasn't here before. You found a slice of, oh, never mind. That's not a hat. It's that butterscotch cinnamon pie. Look at these cool toys. They don't interest you at all. Let's see um, how much that butterscotch cinnamon pie. All HP. One slice. Um, what's up with the cell phone? Call her mom? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> oh, is Toriel a woman? Oh, I guess it does have uh, eyelashes there. Thought it was a dude. To Would that make you happy to call me mother? Well then, call me whatever you like. Click. Uh, say hello. Does all this go to Tor Toriel? <laughs> oh man. Are you bored? I should have given you a book. My apologies. Why not use your imagination to divert yourself? Pretend you are a monarch. 
roll over the leaf pile with a uh, fist of iron. Can you do that for me? Uh, about yourself? This is Toriel. You want to know more about me? Well, I'm afraid there's not much to say. I'm just a silly little lady who worries too much. And last one is Flirt. Oh, uh, ha ha ha. How adorable. I could pinch your cheek. You can certainly find better than an old woman like me. It's Toriel's diary. Yeah, we're gonna read it. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling... Wow, because she was feeling bonely. The rest of the page is filled with jokes of a similar caliber. Yeah, I don't like jokes like that. Most of the time. It's an encyclopedia of a subterranean plant. You open up to the middle typha. A group of wetland flowering plants with brown uh, oblong seed pods. Known more commonly as water sausages. You peek inside. Scandalous. It's Toriel's sock drawer. Ah, the cactus. Truly the most... I have never seen that word before. Uh, sunder, or sundare, of all plants. I, I literally want to click on everything. Inside the drawer are flower seeds and some broken crayons. Room under renovations. Oh, it's a water sausage. It's you. Alright, let's get out of here. It's a, I, I, like it, I'm sorry, I just want to interact with everything just to see what it says. In doing so, you find... Oh, you know what? That fool's in the kitchen. Or he still might be. Well, no, because I think he was getting the butterscotch sediment pie. Up already, I see. I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still... I'm glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? When can I go home? What? This this is your home now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I'm reading? It is called 72 Uses for the Snails. How about it? Here's an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails talk really slowly? Just kidding. Snails don't talk. Interesting. I have to do something. Stay here. So we just asked her if you didn't catch that. How do we exit the ruins? Well, she told me to stay there, but I kind of want to check out what's down here. Oh, never mind. You wish to know how to return home? Do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the playground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. Huh? Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come. They leave. They die. You naive child. If you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I'm only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. I don't know if if, if Toriel is low key like possessive over me and just doesn't want me to leave because she's so lonely, or if she's legitimately telling the truth. You want to leave so badly? Hmph. You are just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove it to me. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Are we about to fight Toriel? We about to fight Toriel. Toriel blocks the way. All right, well, what we got here? Mm. Uh, let's check. Yo, hey, no way we about to win. 80 attack, 80 defense, and no, oh, knows best for you. Very nice. Look at this. Okay, we're supposed to lose this. 
Unless we can talk. Unless we can talk her out of it. We could think of any conversation topics. Ooh! Let's try to talk again. You tried to think of something to say again. Nah, we're gonna survive this. Ooh, that was close. Toria prepares a magical attack. Let's try to talk again. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to the situation. Ooh, yo, we killing it. Toyo is acting aloof. Alright, let's try one more time. Ironically, alright, so we're gonna have to fight. We're gonna have to attack this fool. Cause she out here. Oh my. Alright, we're gonna just have to fight her. Bam. You know what? I think we. Damn. Alright, you know what? No, we're, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna kill her. We're gonna eat some of that that good pie she gave us. What? Oh, you know what? Damn. What's this toy knife do? Take that, Toriel. Woo, we killing it. You know what? I think, I think if we wouldn't try to talk to her so early on, we we, we could have took her out. Yeah, absolutely. We got enough items here. Wow. I don't know how we, I don't know how we survived that. It's only worth 10 HP. Twelve HP. Woo -woo. That's scary. Oh, they tricked me. I wasn't expecting it right there. Yo, that, that hand hits a lot. All right, we're getting there. This seems like a little a safe area right there. Take this fool down. A little safe area right here. I kind of messed it up that time. There we go. Oh, that hurt. Alright, couple more hits. Alright, so have some more monster candy. I'm glad we picked up all that monster candy. Right here, I think it's a safe area. A little bit more up, we would have had that. Bye bye. Fool. Err. You are a stronger. You are stronger than I thought. Listen to me, small one. If you go beyond this door, keep walking as far as you can. Eventually you will reach an exit. Asgore. Do not let Asgore take your soul. His plan cannot be allowed to succeed. Be good. Won't you? My child. Yo, we straight up killed her? That's kind of messed up. All she had to do was let us go. She, you didn't have to die. Nah, that sucks. It sucks for, for Toriel. 
I didn't want to kill you. I just thought, you know, you'd move out the way after we beat you. Kind of like how, you know, Pokemon does. But, jeez. I wasn't trying to kill you. But now we got to figure out who this Asgo or Asgore dude is. He he he. I hope you like your choice. After all, it's not as if you can go back and change fate. In this world, it's kill or be killed. That old hag thought she couldn't break the rules. She tried so hard to save you humans. But when it came down to it... Uh-oh, there's evil sunflower again. He he. She couldn't even save herself. What an idiot. Let's go, Toby Fox. There's a camera hidden in the bushes. That's creepy. All right, so we are officially outside of the safety zone, out in the the underworld. Yo, I like how they switch it up to the uh, 2D perspective. That's dope. I like that. Change of pace. Get a little bit of everything. All right, I hear things in the woods, but I don't see anything running back there. But we on this uh, this long walk here. All right, something's coming. Who's this? Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. Don't shake it. What the f- The old whoopee cushion and the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. Or is that Sans? I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now, but you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother, uh, Papyrus, he's a human hunting fanatic. He's actually, I think, that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Oh, this dude, Sans, might be a good dude. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. Shit. <laughs> Sup, bro? You know what? Sup, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? S staring at this lamp, it's really cool. Do you want to look? <laughs> no, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly desire. Look at his cape waving. Respect. Recognition. I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People will always ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, you are not helping, you lazy bones. Lazy bones. All you do is sit and, uh, boon the doggle? You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. A skeleton. <laughs> See, that made it hot. Sans. Come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it. Sigh. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. <laughs> oh, man. I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more 
backbone into it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, he came back for a head. Okay, you can come out now. You ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does, you have to sit uh, through more of my hilarious jokes. What's the hold up? Look, there's nothing to be afraid of. It's just a dark cavern filled with skeletons and horrible monsters. Well? Alright, that's it. That, that's We've exhausted through all, his, uh, through all his responses. It's some sort of checkpoint or sanctuary, but there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. Actually, hey. Hate to bother you, but can I do can you do me a favor? I was thinking, uh, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million. I'll be up ahead. He said, I'll be up ahead, but he went that way. I'm not going away over there. Just like Toriel said... Hey, wait right here. I'll come back. Oh, the intention was okay. Never mind. She didn't. He, she didn't want us to come so she could do her, do her dirty deeds. Snow Drake flutters float forth. Check. This teen comedian fights to keep a captive audience. My fave ice cereals, Frosted. Ah, oh, I didn't. I'm, I'm going too fast. All right, let's just laugh at the jokes. You laugh at Snow Drake's pun. See, laughs. Dad was wrong. No Drake is pleased with its cool joke. You make a bad ice pun. Nice try. You laugh at Snow Drake's pun. You have good taste. No Drake is again, please. Thanks, you're all great. Alright, so at some point, I feel like we're just gonna have to take this dude out. We'll laugh at one more joke. Alright. Actually, let's just heckle it and see what happens. You boo the snow drake. Insults towards humans. Yeah, well, we're just not to fight him. Ice to meet you. Sorry, you won. You earned 22 experience and 18 gold. Got more love. This is a box. You can put an item inside or take an item out. The same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, a box lover. I want to know what that, um... Weapon at five... For five fingered folks. Hey, what happens if we uh call Toriel's phone? Dang. Alright, so so as I was saying about undying. <laughs>
Sans, oh my god, is that a human? Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Oh, hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my, is that a human? Yes, oh my god. I finally did it. Undying Will, I'm gonna, I'll be so popular, popular, popular! Ahem, human, you shall not pass this area. I, the great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Then, then, I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. The Sands guy seems all right. Don't seem like a bad dude at all. Hey, we can do some fishing. Reel it in? Yeah, we'll reel it in. All that's attached to it is a photo of a weird-looking monster. Call me. Here's my number. You decided not to call. Yeah, that's a uh, that's a dope way to uh, pick up pick up somebody's number, huh? That's new. Ice cap struts into view. This teen wonders why it isn't named Ice Hat. Snow, no, it's Hat Residue. What the hell's going on? Ice Cat makes sure its hat is still here. Whoops, I didn't do it. No, I didn't mean to do that again. Yeah, this kind of reminds me of WarioWare. Uh, Wario Compliment him. Oh, this guy's an asshole. He called us envious. It's snowing dandruff. <laughs> what the? Hey, all right, let's use an item. I just love my hat, okay? Steal, let's steal. You tried to steal the Ice Cap's hat, but it's not weakened enough. Help fashion police. <laughs> yeah, this game is something else. Here comes that new clothes smell. Alright. Well, so much for getting that hat. Alright, looks like we are all out of, uh... Armor Defense 3, if you're cuter, monsters won't hit you as hard. You equip the ribbon. How much stuff can we equip? Oh, okay. Absolutely no moving. Who's this? Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Doggo blocks the way. Easily excited by movement. Hobbies include squirrels. Don't move an inch. Ah, I didn't overreact. Pet. <laughs> what the heck? Pat, pet, pot. Doggo has been pet. You pet Doggo. Where's that coming from? Pot, pet, pot, pot, pat. Let's pet him again. There's no end to it. Doggo has a pet. Alright. We gotta attack this fool. He's there. Ah! Oh, so much for that. Someone's been smoking dog treats. <laughs> Yo. Hey, here's the 
here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move. It won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Oh, snap. I was like, yo, I can't turn. North ice, south ice, west ice. All right, East Snowden Town and Ice. Um, well, let's go off path. Lesser dog appears. Lesser dog. Oh, a lot of a lot of pet options here. Wills a stone dogger made of Palmer granite. Oh boy. Ooh. Alright, let's see what happens if we pet this one. You barely lifted your hand unless your dog got excited. Tiny bark. Oh, I messed up. How? How am I? Whoa. Oh, that's... I think I... Man, that was... I see what I gotta do. But we gotta attack him now. You're supposed to not move, but right when the white one comes close, you gotta dip out. But we need some health. Hello, I am Snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, Traveler, please. Take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Thank you, good luck. You got the Snowman piece. Oh, that's nice of us. Oh, you know what? I probably should have went back and healed before we came over here. You're so lazy. You were napping all night. I think that's called sleeping. Excuses, excuses. Oh no, the human arrives. In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. For you to see. For you see? For you see, this is invisible. Electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sounds like fun, because the amount of fun you will have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. Sans, what did you do? I think the human has the hold the orb. Oh, okay. Hold this, please. All right, so we gotta pay attention to his tracks there. Okay, try now. Incredible, you slippery snail. You solved it so easily, too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother Sans. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, do you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. Keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? Bro, I just need some health. I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer. Hello, would you like some nice cream? It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. 15 gold. Yeah, I'll take some. Here you go. Have a super duper day. This, if this gives me health, I'm all for it. Oh, I need some more of this. That should be good for now. All right, so let's see what this puzzle is about. All right, so we gotta bring this snowball. I see you over there, my boy Sands. What up, boy? You all right with me, bro? 
I ain't got no beef. All right, so we got to get the snowball into that hole. Oh. Oh, so you got to do it before it melts. Okay, challenge accepted, my man. Challenge accepted. Planet Boo accepts this challenge, my man. Alright, well this one isn't going to go very well, so... Jesus, this is hard. And you know what? Let's just... There we go. And now we do a straight kick forward. Oh, get in there. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. Purple. Even when you felt trapped, you took notes and achieved the end of the ball. You're awarded two gold. That's it? Y'all got to do me better than that. I've been thinking about selling treats, too. Want some fried snow? <laughs> oh, hell no. You're right. That's still too low. You're horrible. You wanted to sell me some fried snow for 50 gold. His smell danger rating. Snow smell. Snowman white rating. Can become yellow rating. <laughs> okay, you know what? I get it now. This is just a smell. Puppy blue rating. Smell of rolling around. Weird smell. Humans green rating. Destroy at all costs. This is so weird. Alright, so what, 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 what's really going on here? His and hers. Smell danger rating. Snow smell. Snowman white rating. Can become yellow rating. Unsus unsuspicious smell. Puppy blue rating. Why is it... Why is it... I don't know. I thought, I thought that was a joke about pissing on snowballs, but now I don't think it was. There's a camera hidden inside. It looks like a snowball, actually. It says Snow de Snowdecadron? Snow a, a, a cadron? Oh. A snow echadron. Uh, I can't get through here though. So. Disregard. Human, I hope you're ready for. Sands, where's the puzzle? It's right there on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Hey kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? Monster Kids Word Search. That didn't do anything. Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easy. Easily the hardest. What, really, dude? That easy peasy word scramble? That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder? Crossword. You two are weird. Crosswords are so easy. It's the same solution every time. 
I just throw the boxes in with the letter Z. Because every time I look at the crossword, all I can do is snore. <laughs> Papyrus. Friends difficulty in interesting places. Yesterday he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Ah, finally a save station. Gonna hit this up real quick and restore our health. Let's save. File saved. Awesome. That'll wrap it up for episode 2 of Undertale. As always, if you're enjoying the content here on Planet Boot, having a good time, feel free to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe to stay updated and be a part of the experience. Until next time, be easy.